the boy, that dude, what's his name, the dog got shot by the cop in, uh, in Missouri, St. Louis, whatever? Uh, yeah, I forget his name. I know you're talking about. Well, you know what? Yeah, that's Israel that's working against the Most High by, you know, rising up for that damn motherfucking nigga. Well, they try to, they're doing the same thing as Trey Mom with him. Is, uh, yeah. They keep calling him a child and a baby. He was a grown ass nigga. He was like 18. Yeah, he was 18. A yeah, the Bible nigga. says you grown man at 12 years old. That's right. What the fuck you talking about? He's a baby. A grown ass coon. And anytime you see Al Sharpton and Jesse Jackass Jackson around somewhere, you know something ain't right. You know something ain't right. That's right. But I heard the people, the protesters down there was cursing out Al Sharpton. Yeah, and Obama. <laughs> they were saying that they ain't did shit. And Obama, yeah, both of them. They told him to get the fuck out of there. <laughs> Who is that at? Uh, so, uh, that's good. Hopefully some riots will come here. We need some riots out in this motherfucker. Okay. I would start a ride if I could, but ain't nobody gonna listen to me. Is that the first Samuel that I'm looking for? What's up, homies? The Popo. Oh. oh, yeah, here it is. First Samuel, I don't know think the second Samuel. This is for that, uh... I can't do this. Those down. niggas in um, St. Louis, Missouri, that's fighting, the, you know, they're doing their work against the Lord, I, as usual. Um, this is First Samuel two and six. The yeah, because I ain't heard nobody out there bringing out scriptures in the protest. You know what I'm saying, right? Oh, go ahead. Not one motherfucker. This is First uh, Samuel two and six. The Lord killeth <laughs> and maketh alive. He bringeth down to the grave and bringeth up. Sit on that. What's that nigga's name? I forgot that fat bastard's name. Well, we got internet out here now. Yeah. I should know that now. I done heard his name a thousand times. I'm here. I was just watching Alex Jones earlier today. He was fat, that fat motherfucker. <laughs> He's covering it though. Oh yeah. I guess that's a good thing about Alex. I barely ever listen to a show no more, but I figured now would be a good time to tune in. Every, right, every right, time right. there's a major event, that's a good time to uh, listen to him. You know what I'm saying? I can't take all them commercials and shit every day. Yeah, he making that money, huh? He making some serious money. Here it is. Um, what's his name? Protests at the St. Louis suburb rocked by racial unrest since a white police officer shot an unarmed black teenager to death turned violent Wednesday night. Uh, what that motherfucker's name is? I bet half the protesters don't know his name. 18-year-old <laughs> Michael Brown, that's it. Michael Brown. It's the Michael Brown video. <laughs> <laughs> keep my eye on this thing, somebody. Pick it up. Oh, yeah. Michael Brown. Yeah, Michael Brown got fucked up. Right. <laughs> well, that's what happens when you get the Lord. You don't see that happening to one of us. And one of our children, yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. That didn't happen to my son or your son. Nope. I wonder. I wonder what Michael Brown's mama's like. Oh, I, I wonder what kind of lady she is. Oh shit! I can imagine. She's probably a damn demon. Mama and daddy. If she even got a daddy. Down there fucking with the police, you know. And you know a nigga. He's probably they was down there probably provoking the police anyway. Talking shit. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Because Jake loves to talk shit to the cops like he's bad, you know right, what I mean? Right, right. I mean, that was good. Fuck the police. Right. I don't give a fuck. Yeah. But you gotta be smart. Use your goddamn hand. Yeah. Isaiah 45 and 7. I form the light and create darkness. I make peace and create evil. I, the Lord, do all these things. Oh, yeah. So the Lord, he's the one who created the police. Yeah, right. That's right. <laughs> he, he allows that shit to happen. That's that whooping stick, huh? The Lord allows us to get fucked up by these cops. <laughs> That's right. You know what I mean? That's right. And he ain't saving us either. Yeah. At least not yet. Yeah, that time ain't coming yet. Now, here we go. This is Proverbs 1 and uh, 26. Uh, well, I'm going to start at uh, 24. Because I have called and ye refused 
I have stretched out my hand and no man regarded. I'm sure there are, I've seen a St. Louis camp. Brothers teaching down in St. Mm -hmm. Louis. Yeah. So I mean, I know the words out down in St. Louis. He's probably, you know, there's Israelite brothers out there uh, down there teaching on the streets. Yeah. And they probably scoffed at him. Told him that oh, told him to uh, stop that bullshit and go get money. Right, right. You know, go get money, get money. Mm -hmm. Because I have called and you refused. I have stressed out my hand and no man regardeth, but ye have said it not all my counsel and with none of my reproof. I also will laugh at your calamity. I will mock when your fear cometh. <laughs> right. So right, pretty much the Most High is laughing at your ass when you get uh, beat down by the cops. They shooting rubber bullets at your ass. Ooh. So soon they gonna start shooting real bullets. Rubber yeah, bullets. They out here crying, talking about, oh, they shooting rubber bullets. <laughs> let's see, motherfucker. And tear gas. Let's see how you feel when they shoot you with some real bullets. I'm here. Let's see how you feel when they hit your ass with that uh, the sound wave cannon. Ooh. What that? What's that? The L Rad. Yeah, they got that shit open. And then when they gonna hit you with that sound sound wave, it's gonna make you shit out your intestines. <laughs> right, all that yeah. shit gonna drop out. Yeah, all that shit gonna drop right out. That's funny. I will also laugh at your calamity. I will mock when your fear cometh. When your fear cometh as a desolation and your destruction cometh as a whirlwind, when distress and anguish cometh upon you, then shall they call upon me, but I will not answer. They shall seek me early, but they shall not find me. Yeah, they always protest and won't throw a protest. Who are you protesting to? A protest. Only, pro only one we protest to is the most high. What's that assembly? What's that? Simple scripture. When they be gathering and shit. Man, these niggas ain't woke up and realizing that everything they gonna do is gonna come to naught. It's gonna fail. Especially when they do the same old stupid shit they've been doing since the 40s, 50s, 60s with, Jackson, uh, with uh, Martin Luther's Lucifer Coon, Jesse Jackass. Malcolm X, the same shit, man. These poor people don't never learn, man. Right? Yeah, I mean, they gonna do the same shit, gonna protest. Gather and march and hold hands. Shit is gay. Hey, and then a lot of times the women be leading them. Uh, right, right. They had the loud, boisterous women out there, all emotional, leading them. Y'all just a bunch of faggots, man. <laughs> Pretty much. Right. Essentially, in essence, you're faggots. I don't know when we hear that shit. Actually, we pray the, the most high fucks the motherfuckers up in Ferguson even more. Even more. Because they, they already got the military police out there on your ass. That's right. And they loaded too. And they crying Ooh. about that. Like I said, they wait, there's going to come a moment. They're going to start spraying your ass with real bullets. And we're going to laugh. Look at these damn, look at these proud devils. Fucking spirit of satan you think they ready to do some work no hey can i ask y'all a question what y'all gonna do uh when the riots like down in ferguson pop off of columbus video. uh you out in public they got video cameras on every building filming your ass yeah you, yeah you got red light cameras filming your ass shut up you're a big faggot shut up faggot shut up faggot <laughs> I'm gonna well, I was going. I was trying to ask. I was like, "What all these, all them faggot ass white people? What are they gonna do when the riots pop off here in Columbus, mm -hmm. and you got all, all these Jakes out here going crazy? You know what I'm saying? And they gonna be uh, <laughs> thirsty for the white man's blood? You know what I mean? <laughs> thirsty, <laughs> thirsty, just like we thirsty for it. You know." for two-thirds and them other tribes, you know? And that's the type of white people Jake's gonna go after. Yep. There's them kind right there. Eat the shit. You know what I'm saying? More than likely eat them, Mike. Right, right. You know right, what I'm right, saying? Right, right, right. They going right after them. Second Ezra's nine and one. He answered me then and said, measure thou the time diligently in itself. And when thou seest part of the signs past, which I have told thee before, then shalt thou understand that it is the very same time wherein the highest will begin to visit the world which he made. Therefore, when there shall be seen earthquakes and uproars of the people in the world. Yeah, there's uproars all over the place. That little shit down in Ferguson, 
That's about a spread across the whole United States. That's that spark. Plus, look at what you got going on in Israel right now. You got it down. Their war, the whole world is in chaos. You got the Israelis fucking up the Palestinians. You got the Russians about to start fuck. Well, they are fucking up the Ukrainians. Mm -hmm. That's a big war going on up there. Yep, yep. Um, then shout thou, well understand that the Most High spake of those things from the days that were before thee, even from the beginning. Damn, did I pass my part? Earthquakes and upwards of the people in the world, yeah. For like as all that is made in the world have a beginning and an end, and the end is manifested. This is the end of the Lord's Yeah, we're in the end. It's got to be the end. Yeah. That's right. That's that end. Matthews 24. Because how much fucking further could it go? Right, right. Even so, the times also of the highest have plain beginnings and wonders and powerful works and endings and effects and signs. And those are just part of those signs that's going on over in Ferguson. Yeah, that's a sign. That's a huge sign. That's the signs we be looking for. We be hoping to help our spirit. Because we've been telling people about martial law forever. They'll laugh at mm -hmm. you. Yeah, yeah. But now they, when they rolling the tanks in on your ass. Right. You know what I'm saying? Mowing you down. And we sitting here telling the people about race wars is coming, race wars is coming. They think that's a joke too. Yeah. Ain't that holding the hands across the bed? That shit is old. That shit ain't gonna work. You gonna hold hands with your neighbor and don't. You start punching each fucking other. Uh, oh look, yeah. Let's see when the uh, when the economy collapses. There's no food in the stores. There's no there's no welfare. Yeah, there, there's man. and there's no running water. That's gonna be beautiful. Yeah, let's see how let's see how many hands are gonna be holding across America. Yeah, let's see how many doing. You know what I'm saying? We are the world. Yeah. Oh, this land is your land. <laughs> this land is your That's land. Don't they change that? This in land is my land. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Do they? Uh, yeah. To the New York. <laughs> <laughs> That's that bullshit. They gonna be singing oh, that shit. shit. Oh shit! This is some funny shit going on, man. Even so, the times also of the highest have plain beginnings, and wonders and powerful works, and endings and effects and signs. And every one that shall be saved, and shall be able to escape by his works. Oh, works. And by faith, whereby ye have believed. Now these motherfuckers ain't gonna have faith until the time comes. Hell no. So-called faith, you know. They're in their false works and shit. Their works is what? Just going around saying, I love Jesus. I love Jesus. <laughs> and everyone that ha that shall be saved and shall be able to escape the work, escape by his works and by faith, whereby ye have believed, shall be preserved from the said perils and shall be and shall see my salvation in my land and within my borders for I have sanctified them for me from the beginning and that sounds like he's only talking about the elect not just every fucking body then shall they be a pitiful case which <laughs> now have abused my ways oh that's oh yeah that's Israel abused the that's Lord's way right. you know what I'm saying they, they don't, not a single one of them is following the, even the Ten Commandments. They, can, they can't keep, that's the toughest to keep. I mean, you want to talk about keeping a, uh, don't eat pork? These fools can't even stop committing adultery. Right, right, right. They don't right. even believe in the Most High. Right, right. Yeah. They'll never give up pork. Hell yeah, no. Hell yeah, no. I wonder, if you, I wonder if your boy that got shot in St. Louis, I wonder if he ate pork. Yeah, he's probably just eating a bacon sandwich. Bacon and sausage sandwich. His mom probably feed him bratwurst and ham sandwiches. Ooh, that very same day. He probably just stopped in his licking his fingers and shit. Big fat motherfucker. That's worthy of death, actually. Oh, um, you know it should be. You know. That's some if a pork it actually eating pork is Ooh. foul, man. Ooh. That's some of the nastiest shit a person could do. Now that's an Edomite. Yeah, that dude's a big faggot. That's an Edomite. <laughs> shit. Um. Then shall they be a pitiful case which now have abused my ways, and they that have cast them away pitifully shall dwell in torments. For such as in their life have received benefits and have not known me, and they that have lost my law while they had yet liberty, 
And when as yet place of repentance was open unto them, understood not, but despised it. Right. Says, Even like well, yeah, well, like when the Lord returned, like when the Lord when the Lord was walking on the earth two thousand years ago. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Did, did, what did Israel say? They said, uh, crucify him. Crucify him, crucify him. Yeah, we have no king but Caesar. Yep, that sounds like a nigga. That's what they said to, to the repentance. Yep, and also, what did he say? Uh, his, or his blood should be on our hands? Yeah. Let me get that, man. Let me just get it. Let's get that. Uh, where is you about to get? Matthew 20, uh, towards what we're talking about. There's a few good parts. I like the part when the Lord's cursing out the scribes and Pharisees. And he says, the, the, you the children of Jerusalem slay at the prophets all the day long or something like oh, that. Oh, right, right, That's a good one, too. But I know what you're talking about. That's in Matthew 20. Uh, I was thinking of um, what is Luke for? Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, let me just look yeah. Matthews. Yeah, because when the Lord came on the scene 2,000 years ago, uh, most people came against him. Yeah. The, those that the, a lot of people that followed him was only following him to get food, free food to get healed some people he would heal people and a lot of them wouldn't even really you know be that appreciative of it right. man hey hell yeah i've seen enough pretty face okay here we go this is matthews uh 27 i'm gonna start at 23 and the governor said why why what evil have he done but they cried out the more saying, let right. him be crucified. When Pilate saw that he could prevail nothing, but that rather a tumult was made, he took water and washed his hands before the multitude saying, I am innocent of the blood of this just person. See ye to it. Yeah, right. You motherfucker, he's going to slavery too, nigga. Like you talking about Pontius? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, he was no damn good too. Damn right. He was a goddamn Edomite. The, right. the, 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 when Pontius Pilate was talking to the Lord, you can read in the book of John, John uh, the Lord is ignoring his ass. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Right, right, right. And he pretty much said he wasn't, he, he didn't think, he didn't think Pontius Pilate was shit. Right. You know? See ye to it. Then answered all the people and said, his blood be on us and on our children. <laughs> but really, that the blood is on Israel, though. Yeah, yeah. Even though it was Roman, yeah. the Romans who physically killed him, yeah. it was really... Because actually, the Lord... Took that verbal oath for it, it says that. Where's that scripture that says that? It says the, uh, that you have committed the greater sin. He, he's told, it, told Is, the Israelites that crucified him mm -hmm. that they had committed the greater sin than the Romans. Right, right, right. Oh. I could look it up. Ah. I can get it. I know, it's just... I can get it. Then answer all the people and said, his blood be on us and on our children. We're going to have to get a tripod, man. Yeah. Because it seems like we the only uh, faithful brothers in this whole goddamn city, man. <laughs> you know? I used to Seriously, have... man. We the only faithful brothers in this whole goddamn city, man. I had it. What about Peraza? Oh, Peraza. <laughs> <laughs> I had a tripod and fucking sold it. That was dumb. Then release he bar Barabbas unto them. And we had scourged Yehoshua. He delivered him to be crucified. Then the soldiers of the governors took Yahushai into the common hall and gathered unto him the whole band of the soldiers and they stripped him and put on him a scarlet robe. Yeah, because that scarlet and purplish. Uh, yeah, just like the Roman Caesars wore it. Let me find that other one. Hey, it's in John, I think. Go, go to John, the crucifix historian John, where he's talking to Pontius Pilate. We should just read that whole thing. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Cause this is going back, like we said, we just showing you how, how Israel, the Lord's chosen people. That's who we out here for is the elected Israel. We are out here to wake up the elected Israel. All right, fuck everybody else. But we out here to tell people, like we making this video talking about them riots and all those people out there rioting and protesting. They're not out there doing the work of the Lord. The Lord is not with that, okay? The Lord ain't with no Ferguson. He ain't with no damn St. Louis. And he sure in the hell wouldn't with that, wasn't with that, uh, what's his name, Michael Brown, that got shot in the back of his goddamn head <laughs> by a fucking cop. <laughs> right, right. Where was that angel that protected his ass? Do you know? You know what I'm saying? No angel. They're wrong, they're under their wrong name, Jesus. 
He ain't even probably under the name of Jesus. He's probably, under he probably under the name of Lil Wayne or uh, Jeezy. Yeah, yeah, or... I stand corrected because that's where it's at. That's the reality of it. Little Wayne or... That's the names they come in. That's right. That's right. Yeah, I mean, they pretty much pray to them. That's right. That's right. They, they quote the rap songs like that scriptures. You know how we hit, like, you know where's that scripture at? Matthew? They be like, you don't remember that uh, that uh, young Wheezy, that, that song? Yeah. They be like that lyric. They quote that shit like a scripture. Right, right, right. <laughs> to them, that is their scriptures, though. I know it. I know it. Just like the devil worshippers got the Necronomicon, these uh, Jakes out here in the hood, they got their uh, they got their rap music. That's their the scriptures. Foolish that's, people. That's their prophets. Foolish <laughs> people. You said when he was talking to Pilate again? Yeah, that's like towards the end You're of right John. There. I'm at 19, 19. Now. Then Pilate therefore took Yahweh and scourged him. Well. Uh, yeah, just read it from there. Okay. It's kind of long, but I think it's got a bunch of red yeah, letters. You know, yeah, yeah, go ahead. Say, say really yeah. Then Pilate therefore took Yahweh and scourged him. And the soldiers plated a crown of thorns and put it on his head. And they put it on, his, on him a purple robe. Yeah, because they put a crown of thorns because he was the, he was the king. He was the king of Israel. And he was making mockery. And he was making fun of him. What yeah. kind of king are you? Yeah. We're going through the same thing. They yeah. make and right. Us out here. I guarantee you, if we was down there in Ferguson, in the midst of those riots, reading these scriptures, oh man, they'd probably come out and tr try to kill us. Yeah. Yeah. They they would hate every last word that we would speak. Every word, and there's proof of it. You know, these people, man, fuck them. And the soldiers plated a crown of thorns and put it on his head, and they put it on him a purple robe and said, "Hell." King of the Jews. Yeah, purple robe. Remember that goes back to royalty. Mm -hmm. That's why that dude Nathaniel Seven on YouTube always wears purple. He claiming he's royalty. Claiming. Heathens. Pilate therefore went forth again and said unto them, Behold, I bring him forth to you, that ye may know that I find no fault in him. Then came Yahweh Shai forth. Right. right. Even the devil said that he did, the Lord didn't do nothing wrong. Now, even the devil. You're you know right. What I mean? mm. Mm -hmm. He couldn't try him for no reason. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, right. keep going. Then came Jehoshaphat forth wearing the crown of thorns and the purple robe, and Pilate said unto them, Behold, the man. When the chief priests therefore and officers saw him, they cried out, saying, Crucify him, crucify him. Pilate said unto them, Take ye him and crucify him, for I find no fault in him. The Jews answered him, We have a law, and by our law he ought to die, because he made himself the son of the Most High Yahweh. When Pilate therefore heard that saying, he was more afraid. Oh, that's your girl? Yeah. That shit is good. I'll go ahead. <laughs> and went again into the judgment hall and said unto Yahushai, Whence art thou? But Yahushai gave him no answer. That's what you're talking about. He ignored his ass. Oh, yeah. He asked him a question. He just ignored his ass. Right. Then said Pilate unto him, Speakest thou not unto me? Knowest thou not that I have power to crucify thee? And have power to release thee? No, no. look, look, Pilate said he had the power to he, crucify him. Right, right, he had the power. Hey, like, Pilate had the power. But listen, this is what the Lord told Pilate. <laughs> Yahweh Shai answered, Thou couldest have no power at all against me. <laughs> he got no, none, none. <laughs> so, like, when y'all... <laughs> that's that's why this, Lord, that's what goes back to the government. The government has no power. These, cop, right. these cops have no power. That's right. All them tanks and bullets and missiles... Those are all property of the Most High. That's right. And okay. He keeping it real, even though he's still in, in bonds, just like when we got locked up in New York. Yeah. We were still doing he the keeping jail, it real. Behind, yep. Behind bars, we still teaching motherfuckers behind. Yeah, bars, we was teaching you know? the cops. You know what I'm saying? Right. Right. Uh, Peter was teaching the cops when. He, uh, Peter. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah. yeah. When he got uh, Paul, was it Peter? Paul? No, Paul, Peter. Paul, Paul. Yeah, well, it was Peter. When Peter. Yeah, they got. They, yeah, they both got they locked both up. Them. Yeah. Well, all, all the disciples got locked That's up. That's right. And they yeah. was teaching. And they were converting, converting the, the guards. You know what I'm saying? What you think uh, Dave doing? Uh, no, no. We, when next time we talk to Dave, he's like, I was going hard in there. Right, right, right. right, right. I got locked up just so I could teach. Yeah, yeah. He gonna say something crazy. Oh, we we probably won't see him. Again. He's gonna be like the Most High is dealing with me. Yeah, that's right. But right. yeah, that's why what he was saying too. Got uh, the shot in his hand, going to rob a motherfucker. Yeah, that's what happened. He, yeah, got, he probably used the name and everything. He probably did. You know what I'm saying? Most high. Dude, that one day he stole that gin. Oh, I'm And he, he told me he stole the gin in the name of the Lord. And he said the name of the Lord. In the name of the Lord. 
I had heard enough on it. <laughs> <laughs> right, right, man. <laughs> oh, man. Thou shalt answer, thou couldst have no power at all against me, except it were given thee from above. Yeah, so these cops have no power. The president has no fucking power. Putin has no power. Putin, they're all in the hands of the Most High. Mm -hmm. Just like the book of Job uh, 33 when it says, the Lord, when while you sleep and the Lord programs you yep, yep, and puts, yep. you know what I'm saying? Yep, yep. There ain't no free will. So, so, I mean, obviously, we can say the white man's the devil. He is the devil, but the Lord controls his ass. The Lord made him the devil. That's you know right, what I'm saying? That's right. That's right. What's that, that Job? Job 33 or something. Yeah. Yeah. Um, this is Job 33 and 14. For the most high, your house speaketh once, yea, twice. Yet no, yet man perceiveth it not. In a dream, in a vision of the night, when deep sleep falleth upon men, and slumberings upon the bed, then he openeth the ears of men and sealeth their instructions. Yeah. That's bad, man. That is more so, to it. It's real, there's a little more. Okay. That he may withdraw man from his purpose. So a so man ain't got no purpose. The man's purpose is to do what the most high programmed his ass to do. I said, Oprah? <laughs> it's like nah. She take your view of that gut, man. She be bad. Oh yeah. That's a nigga woman though. Got a no discipline to have a good uh, diet. Hell no. She do a little exercise. She eat nothing but pork. She's ruining her body, man. I bet she's a Jew. She's still nice. Feel kind of good though. Gonna be banging the shit out of them Jews too. So, some of them, some of them Jew bitches church. might be Israelites. Yep, 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 yep. That he may withdraw man from his purpose and hide pride from man. He keepeth back his soul from the pit and his life from perishing by the sword. Yeah, that's the point on that's that one. Point, yeah. Let me go back to uh, John again. Um, yeah, so that disproves free will. Like you got the right to make a choice. There ain't no fucking choice. Shoot. People try to say that the Lord chose them. Mm -hmm. Or not the Lord chose them, they chose the Lord, my fault. Uh, yeah, right, I got right. it backwards. Like, yeah, right. They chose the Lord like the Lord on their job and shit. Like they somebody or some fucking... Like, like when Lord. you go to church, I'm like, do you uh, accept Jesus in your heart today, <laughs> Sister Mary? <laughs> right. <laughs> 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 you can't accept you. shit, man. You know, mm. thou couldst have no power at all against me, except it were given thee from above therefore he hath delivered me unto thee see see right because he said there's no power given to you except for above from above mm -hmm. it says the most high that gave you that power and it's the most high that let you arrest me and it's the most high is going to let you kill me yeah here this is what you were talking about right here therefore he that delivered me unto thee have the greater sin yeah whoever that's delivered it. That's it. the lord unto Pilate, which was the israelites, israelites. The real Jews, yep. not those devils over there in the land of Israel today. They wasn't, they wasn't there. Be right. <laughs> you yeah. know what I'm saying? Right, right. That was the real Jews right there. Actually, they were there. Hey, Rod was an Edomite. Mm -hmm. You know, Hey Rod was an Edomite. Pontius was an Edomite. Yeah. But they weren't Israelites though. Right. You know what I'm saying? But so, so yeah, read that part again real quick. Okay. That, was, that sounded good. Uh, John 19 and 11. Your how shall I answer? Thou couldst have no power at all against me, except it were given thee from above. Therefore, he that delivered me unto thee hath the greater sin. I mean, you know, just that can go against these people that could call the cops on us, delivering us to the cops. Yeah, that's either. how they do it. Same shit. I and mean, it's the same shit, right? It's the same shit. We're going to the same shit. But that's how your was it. We, he wants us to do the same shit. Man, I, I, that way damn I got another good point, too, to add to that. Like down in those rights, down in Ferguson. Mm -hmm. Uh, like a lot of those women out there protesting talking, They protesting against the cops But how many of those same women are out there getting child support on their husband oh, going buddy. to the government? How oh. many of those same women are calling the cops on their baby's daddy every other night? Yep, yep. I, I say 95% of them out there if not, so, if But not now all of a sudden they're, they, mm -hmm. they're calling for justice. Right, no right. justice, no peace. Right. All that bullshit. Right. Man, you hoes deserve to be put to death. The Lord put a foul spirit on those people, man. <laughs> Out there fighting against that, fighting for somebody that they don't give a fuck about. Now look at the what the fuck is that? Man, oh man, oh man, this is a crazy society we living in, man. 
Fucking freak. A uh, creep. Hey, <laughs> creep. That's a creeper. Some out of goddamn video game. That's something you find out in a dungeon of a video game on Zelda or something. Man, look. That's a skirt. Is he wearing a fucking skirt? That's a skirt, man. What a fucking weirdo. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, they're freaking out about it too, I think. <laughs> Uh -huh. And from this poor pilot sought to release him, but the Jews cried out, saying, If thou let this man go, thou art not Caesar's friend. Whosoever maketh himself a king speaks against him. Death to America. Oh, my fault. <laughs> he threw a pop on Met at us. Oh, hell no. Well, he don't know. Oh, yeah, I know. They just think that means rock and roll, dude. Rock and roll, dude. When Pilate therefore heard that saying, he brought Yahweh forth and sat down in the judgment seat in a place that is called the pavement. But in the Hebrew, Gabatha, Gabatha. I looked that up and forgot what it meant. Where, where is uh, uh, where he was sitting? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it means what it says. Oh, in a place that is called the pa yeah. And it was the pre preparation of the Passover in about the sixth hour, and he said unto the Jews, "Behold, your king." He said, "Your king." This actually, the Lord was the king mm -hmm. when he was born. People brought gold to him, so he was rich, had gold. And they just ain't give him a couple coins. He had gold. I mean, he had stacks of gold. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So he was the king. They knew he's the king. They knew he's the Messiah. And this is how they treat him. That's right. The wicked niggas. But they cried out, away with him, away with him, crucify him. Pilate said unto them, shall I crucify your king, the chief priest? Answer, what ha we have no king but Caesar. They said, that's, the, that's what Israel said. We have no king but Caesar. Like Jake today, they worship a Barack Obama. They call him the chosen one. You know what I'm saying? They say he was the new Messiah. You know what I'm saying? Uh, they say he's the new Jesus. These people ain't gonna wake up. Man. So they have no, and Obama's the Caesar. A United States is what? The reincarnation of the Roman Empire. And the Roman Empire called their kings Caesars. Well, today we don't we don't call them Caesars. They just call them presidents. It's the same fucking thing. Same shit. Okay. Same shit. Just how the ancient Romans used the eagle that represents Jupiter, the United States uses the eagle which represents Jupiter or Zeus. That's why the presidential seal is what a fucking eagle. The presidential seal has an eagle on it, just like America's main symbol is the eagle. That goes back to ancient Rome. Because that the eagle represents Jupiter's golden eagle. That's why the United States Marine Corps symbol is an eagle globe and an anchor. And that's why the Marine Corps' motto is Semper Fidelis, which is Latin. And the Romans spoke Latin. And Semper Fidelis means always faithful. Always faithful to what? To motherfucking Rome. To Jupiter. To Sodom. I, remember, I was listening to this, this old hillbilly song uh, I think it was some fucking confederate song or something Some hillbilly singer It's a song that says down with the eagle and up with the cross wow. Maybe, You know he's a Christian though right. You know we don't get we don't get into that cross symbolic We don't use them type of symbols Okay we don't use a symbol of a cross We don't just come out here wearing crosses and shit We ain't telling you to do that I'm just telling you about that song Because right. in his eyes that cross represented the bible and he said down, but he knew what that, that eagle represented. It. it represented motherfucking Jupiter. He knew. So he said down with the eagle and up with the cross. I think I actually think that's the name of that song. It's an old, it's a hillbilly song. I think I found it watching Civil War videos. I'm trying to find it when they talk about the Rome, the eagle. Is that oh, the 11th? Is 11? I think that's 11. Talk about the eagle? Well, it mentions... It, oh, yeah, it talks about worshiping Jupiter. Uh, oh, yeah, I know where you're at. Then, oh, and Ezra's. Mm, oh, I'm thinking, 11. Okay. Then saw I a dream, and behold, there came up from the sea an eagle. Oh, yeah, that's going into the Roman Empire. Roman Empire, right. And then... And that's th not America. <laughs> then it starts breaking down all the different Caesars. Mm -hmm, right which had 12 feathered wings and three heads. And I saw and behold, she spread her wing over all the earth and all the winds of the air blew on her and were gathered together. And I beheld and out 
of her feathers, there grew uh, other contrary feathers and they became little feathers and small. But her heads were at rest, the head in the mist was greater than the other, yet rested it with the residue. Moreover, I beheld, and lo, the eagle flew with her feathers and rained upon earth and over them that dwelt therein. And I saw that all things under heaven were subject, uh, subject unto her, and no man spake against her. Oh no. yeah, you ain't speaking against Rome. Mm -hmm. Okay. And Rome, Rome is all about authority. You know what I'm saying? Caesar authority and power. Right, yeah, because, and why, he said, Rome controlled the whole known earth. and still does. I mean, this is Rome we living in. If this ain't Rome, like I said, why is the Marine Corps, they said the Marine Corps is what, the, the finest, right? Yeah. The, the elite of the military. I, mean, I was in the Marines. <laughs> so why the fuck is, that we speaking Latin? When we was in the Marines, you know what we used to say every 10 minutes? What's that? Oorah. What? You always say oorah. And I guess that's what the Latin, the, I mean the Roman legions, when they was fighting, they'd be like oorah, it means kill. <laughs> oh, okay. It means to kill. That comes from the from the Roman, ancient Romans, man. So if you ain't gonna tell me America's not Rome. That's why the Capitol building, I said, we said it a billion times. Is, so y'all know riots are coming to Columbus just like in Ferguson? Hallelujah. And all you white people gonna run for your lives. You're gonna be scared to death. Oh, yeah, there's a ginger up in there. Yeah, they look they look good. They just hanging out with weirdos. Alright. What you about to read? Oh, what's that? Go Oompa Loompa. I know the school starts up soon, don't it? Right, right, right. Um, this is Jeremiah 49. Loud ass shit. Yeah, loud ass fire trucks and shit. What's up, homie? Got your ass on camera. She's like, she's like, I'm like, thick, man. Hell yeah. Nice, too. This is Jeremiah 49 and 7, concerning Edom. Edom, that's Esau. The so-called white elite people to control the earth. And the one. Thus said the Lord of hosts, Is wisdom no more in teeming? Is counsel perished from the prudent? Is their wisdom vanished? Oh, uh, um, you know, I was just listening to a heavy metal song the other day. I was on SoundCloud. It's some band, I can't remember the name. Some power metal band. But they have this song, it's called The Kings of Edom. What? what, for real? Yeah, they were singing about the Kings of Edom. I think they mentioned T-Man and Day-Dan in it. Oh, hell and they, no. Yeah, it's a, some all oh, heavy metal song. Oh, wow, you know. You I gotta find it on that. SoundCloud. I was just listening to it like yesterday. For real? Please, just please. get on SoundCloud and type in uh, Kings of Edom. Right. SoundCloud. Yes, you know, so you I ain't got SoundCloud. Internet. I ain't got no internet. Oh, shit. Because what happened was, you know how the update comes on the side of the computer and update your uh, the program. The fuck your shit up? Um, well, what I did was it offered me the new 14.04, yeah. the new upgrade for uh, the Ubuntu. And I, yeah. I pushed it, the upgrade, right? I accidentally uh, uh, stopped it. Oh, man. And that's what fucked it up. Yeah. I accidentally pushed... Uh, you can probably redo it. I've been trying to. I can't do oh, it. Man. Man. I'm trying to. Fuck. I meant to bring you a disc. I forgot it at home. I followed you to the crib. Fuck, here. man. Okay. Go uh, ahead. Flee ye turn back, dwell deep, O inhabitants of the dam. For I will bring the calamity of Esau upon him the, the time that I will visit him. And that's kind of funny, funny weird, though, because no one knows who Edom is. No. You know? They, I mean, they know who King Herod in the Bible is. They didn't know he was the Edomite, did they? Okay. Is that the one with the little part of Fox? Yeah, uh, yeah. The Fox. Yeah. Oh, him, and like a, a him and his sons. Yeah. Like a oh, wow. he's sly like a fox. Yep. What's that one? Uh, what's that old saying? Like a fox. Uh, <laughs> yeah, whatever. Right. You know, a fox is a sneaky motherfucker. Oh, shit, man. I swear I can't think right today. Man. Yeah, me neither, man. I've been fucked up all week. It's probably that big ass moon fucking with us. Yeah, I'm on You seen that how big that goddamn moon yeah, is? Yeah, I saw it. I saw it. Oh, wow. Yeah, that was... This is Esau. What's up, Esau's? 
Edomites. If great gatherers come to thee, will they not leave some great gleaning, gleaning grapes? If thieves by night. Now Esau, Esau don't leave no grapes. Yeah, take it all. Take the whole goddamn tree. <laughs> yeah, he, he uproot that motherfucker yeah. and then take burn it tree. and then put salt in the dirt. I've seen that on the <laughs> internet, man. They actually uproot trees and move them somewhere else. Just now. so you can't have it. Damn right. <laughs> damn right. It's crazy, man. Um, they will destroy till they have enough. But I have made Esau. Here. Yeah, don't that sound like America and Rome? Mm -hmm. So how you gonna? We know who Esau is by his characteristics. I mean, that describes Rome and America to the T, perfectly. I mean, America's never full. It's never had enough. I mean, look how fucking fat these people are in this country. I mean, that, that, that's just uh, that's just reflective of the government's policies. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Eat till you can't eat enough. They eat and not even be hungry. Right. Well, just like in ancient Rome, it's famous that they'd have eating parties. And when everybody got so full from eating, they just puke and then eat some more. Yeah. How yeah. disgusting is that? Right, right. They call what's what's the name for that? Uh, Binging. I don't know. Uh, they call but bu that's what the uh, bulimic. Bu bulimic bitches. Yeah. Just, just that's America. But I have made Esau bear. I have uncovered his secret places. Yeah, mm -hmm. secret places. Like that's talking about all these conspiracy theories coming out. You know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, Obama getting caught up in all these scandals. Different government officials getting caught up in scandals. The IRS getting caught. They getting caught uh, robbing people for no reason. They, they get, talks about all this shit being exposed. Uh, Edward Snowden. That's a big one. Yeah, he's talking about coming out with some uh, some holy grail of secrets now. Uh, he should have been came out with it. What the fuck you waiting for? You know what I'm saying? So he's probably do, doing some dirty double dealing with the Russians and probably he's a triple agent with the British, U.S. and it's the Russians. Yeah. Up. You if, if you had all that dirt, you would have been brought it out. What the oh fuck God. you waiting on? It's been over a goddamn year right. since we first seen your ass. <laughs> right, right. Now I made Esau there. I have uncovered his secret places and he shall not be able to hide himself. His seed is spoiled, and his brethren and his neighbors. Look at this nice young lady. She's wearing a dress. I found that to be odd. Mm. See? See? Why can't the rest of you hoes do that? Mm -hmm. They want to be a man. They got a uh, penis in them. That's why these bitches wear pants. And then she look a lot more... Uh, a lot more feminine and ladylike wearing a dress. She's cute. Yeah, I'm, she looks cute. She's cute. Right. She's a cute little redhead. Right. And she could be wearing some, uh, what's some tight ass shorts. You can see her pussy. That's not cute to me. That just makes me look like I'm supposed to offer you money or something. 